So today is what I like to call just uh, a re reconnaissance day. Is that a word? Reconnaissance? Like just a day where you kind of look around to see what you're up against. I've never been here before. I always wanted to go. And I saw the Northern Lights yesterday from the plane. And it's quite something. And I actually tried to take a picture <laughs> with my camera from the plane to capture the Northern Lights. <laughs> it didn't work, this piddle like that. I was really happy when the band got the chance to play here because I always wanted to go to Tromsø and this was a great opportunity to just go and have a look-see getting to know the town a bit before uh, because I'm definitely heading back here some other time when I have uh, when I'm more equipped for a photography trip because I don't think you're gonna get far without a car here just walking around takes forever and you need to get high up or uh, drive to the best spots for the Northern Lights or the big whistles around the city. So now I think I'm gonna go down to the seaside. So it's a it's a beautiful light. It's as it's as light as it's gonna get, I think, because the sun never really gets up in this place. It's uh, I think the first time they see sun is around January 21st or something. So. They have a few months, but it's kind of black. And I have a few hours before we need to get ready to play our concert tonight. At least I brought my camera, because you never know, I'm an eternal optimist. There might be Northern Lights, there might not be Northern Lights. This place is famous for its Northern Lights, so I couldn't leave my camera back home. I'm not sure if you can hear me, but it's really, really windy. But I, I found a place where I kind of get a nice show over the mountains behind me. And I'm going to do a couple of ones handheld and shoot, move around freely, not be constricted by a tripod. really really cold my fingers are a bit reddish so I'm thinking maybe my band is starting to wake up now there's the church I see the church now here let me show you in the middle of the frame now I'm gonna zoom in there's the church so I need to get over there one way or another Given that the sun doesn't actually rise in this place at this time of year, it's like a never-ending sunrise. That's the word I used to describe it, I think. Never-ending sunrise. So the clouds are constantly changing color, variating from a really dark orange to light orange to red to dark brownish red. It is truly a beautiful city. There are a lot of lions here, and I do like a lot of lions. It's it's a, it's a, yeah it's a it's a well crafted city I think, and the clouds, well, <laughs> it's like the clouds are like a painting today. It's like somebody painted them on.
So, I made it to uh, Isas Katadalen in the end. Sound check is approaching and the daylight is fading, so I need to call this uh, call it quits today, I think. Uh, it's been fun walking around doing some touristy stuff. Thank you for watching and take care of each other and I'll see you in about a week, I guess. Alright, thank you.